Hey guys, welcome back to my luxury and lifestyle channel. Um, as I just said in part two, if you watched it, if you didn't watch it, go back, go watch it. So you can see the, the build up to where we're at right now. I will be going down in my elevator that is actually in my condo. So the super cool thing about this condo is that I just saw some light up on the, the car. So the super cool thing about this condo is that um, if you love privacy, you don't really like people, you know that people are just weird, this is perfect for you, you don't have to see anyone. So our elevator is actually inside of our condo. For my condo, I actually have it on, I have a two floor condo. So on my second floor, that's where my car garage is. So my, con my, my car is parked inside of the condo, as I said before. Um, so if you're trying to leave your condo and not trying to go through front, you're not trying to see anybody on the elevator and stuff like that, this is perfect. If you want to people or you want basically just have them send it down for you can do that. This is the only car elevator in the world where you can actually sit in the car and have it go down with you. There's other car elevators, but you cannot sit in the car. But this one, the only one in the world, and he... I'm the developer um, patent it. So the Bentley tower will be coming and the Lamborghini tower will be coming after and he's the one who's actually doing it. So if you know by now where we're at, this is the Porsche design tower and I'm so excited to show you guys the process. This is one of the main reasons why I even took this condo. And yeah, like I love it, love it. So we're gonna jump into it. The first thing that we have to do is call car concierge. Um, they're open 24 7 of course you're in the building and all um, not only that um, of course you can turn your car on in the elevator as a matter of fact let me actually show you guys some stuff you can turn the car on in the elevator I think it's like a twenty thousand dollar fine or something like that so don't do it but I'm gonna just show you like kind of like a setup so here on the ground um, you're gonna have um, these, I don't know what to call it. Okay, you can see here has the regular tile, but here has like a plate or something. And here has the elevator, which the door goes up. So what happened is that we call car concierge and tell them what car we, we meaning people who just live in the building and stuff, you know. Um, so we're gonna call car concierge. Good morning, Hi, good morning. This is Christina. Do you mind bringing the red Lamborghini down, please? Sure, I'll bring it down now. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye. You too. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Okay, so we call the concierge. If you had one car, you can tell them to bring a car down. The reason I said I just said the name is because I have two cars. So what happened is that when the car is almost here, you're gonna see like um, a light over here and stuff. This one here, not sure if you can see it. Yes, see, start blinking. No, this might seem like this elevator, you know, regular elevator breaks so much on a regular day. This, to be honest guys, one time it ever been broken and I think it was yesterday. They have regular maintenance, like once a month and stuff like that, where they ask if you want them to bring their car down, your car down and stuff, but here, no. Once that light start blinking, you can't open the door anymore. You cannot, um, put your hand out or anything like that because what happened is going to be censored and you don't want to throw off the elevator so when you say break and stuff like that kind of so like you know some you might have friends over and it might be something that is so cool to them and they probably stand up and no don't do that literally don't do that so i'm probably gonna put my thing like this let me see if i can see it that way so i'm gonna hold it like this so that way you guys can see um it open up and everything like that and the cool thing for people like me who can parallel park for nothing, parallel parking for me is either hit or miss. Is either I do it really good or I do it really bad. So it's going up right now. So it's all glass. So what's happening is that it sent out this um, thing. I'm a girl, I'm a girly girl. <laughs> um, it's gonna go below the car, lift it up, it just lift it, and then it's gonna pull it onto the elevator. So now 
while we're inside of that container. I feel like I like a group, you know. I normally never do this. Okay, so now it's going long. And then it's going down now. Look up. Can hold it this way now. So again, you realize you're alone. The other car was on another elevator and all, but the privacy is every single thing. So can see outside. It's probably gonna be it's hella bright. We're passing the lobby and then now we are outside not outside the lighting in here is not letting us be great okay. hopefully you can see so we go So it's extremely secure, you can't move no like people in the car. <laughs> battery died so we have to be recording with uh, my phone right now ah. so it's gonna go up Oh, cool. And you see, I didn't have to deal with anybody apart from calling them on the floor, um, on the phone. Apart from that, I didn't have to deal with anyone or anything. So again, this is like, I can tell you already off the top, like five ways where this is amazing. Like if you just gave birth, you don't want your kid to be around people and stuff newborn. Perfect. If you just had plastic surgery, you don't want nobody to see it at worst. Perfect. If you don't like people, very antisocial. Perfect. Um, if you're messing with somebody who you know you have no business messing with, <laughs> perfect. Or if you look crazy, like you have a prison corner where you don't have it on your wig, it is trying to rush to our drive through real quick, perfect. So, five reasons. So this is it. It's gonna bring us back in. Size my condo. And we're back. Can you tell I love this condo? <laughs> and this is one off, guys. I like one off. I guess probably like every week I'll probably do one. Oh my god, guys, I'm telling you. Um I'm Let's wait for it to go back on. But yeah, on the next video, not the next, I'm not, I'm not gonna say the next. Let's do it for now. Let's build out the anticipation. But there's another super, 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 super cool feature. There's many cool features to my condo. That's why I don't leave my house because I have no reason to. But um, yeah, it's gonna be closing. Don't basically hop out because again, this is like a sensor to ensure that it's not going to run over nobody. Um, and remember, the G-Wagon is £6,000 on its own, so imagine. In here, it's completely private. Um, there's no cameras here or anything like that. Um, so, again, awesome. If you have kids who 
you know, a lot of times they have to take stuff out of the car. If you have to take stuff out of the car, it just brings you right into your house. You can always like, just put it on the elevator and it brings it up to the main floor. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Um, again, that's why I was so emotional while I was um, in the, the second video because it's just so amazing how, you know, great life can be if you're determined that this is what is going to be for you. So we're going to basically get up right now. And we are going to um, go in the house. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything that you guys would like to know in regards to this video, please let me know in the comment section. Until then, I'm bye.